your question is prove identity see the what they have given tan square x minus sin square x is equal to tan square x sin square x so first we will do this then we will go for this so you can see here so here they have given tan square x minus sin square x so now we will write in terms of sin and cos that means basic so tan square x is what it is sin square x by cos square x minus sin square x so now we will take here lcm so lcm will be your cos square x so here comes by 1 so now it will be sin square x minus cos square x and sin square x cos square x sin square x so if you see in numerator sin square x is common that only we have to take it out so here comes sin square x now in bracket it will be 1 minus cos square x by cos square x so now sin square x by cos square x is tan square x and 1 minus cos square x is sin square x so this is your LHS and RHS is also same so LHS is equal to RHS comes to your second one here they have given cos to the power of 4x plus sin to the square x is equal to sin to the power of 4x plus cos square x. How we will convert it? So here cos to the power of 4x we normally used to write cos square x whole square. It will be cos square x whole square plus sin square x. Now, cos square x is what? It is 1 minus sin square x. That only we have to write. 1 minus sin square x whole square plus sin square x. Now, this is a minus b whole square. So, we have to write it in a square plus b square minus 2ab. So it will be 1 then plus sin to the power of 4x minus 2 sin square x. Here comes plus sin square x. Now, so here sin to the power of 4x plus 1 now <coughs> 2 sin square x plus sin square x is minus sin square x so now here it comes sin to the power of 4x plus 1 minus sin square x is cos square x so this is your LHS and RHS is also same. So this is equal to RHS. So like this we have to prove it.